All right, hello everyone. So I have a bunch of these little canvases that I am planning on making like a little series out of. They're all going to be themed with the color pink just because I've been meaning to do that for a while. And of course, pink is like my favorite color. So um, that's really about it. I'm planning on selling these at a flea market whenever I have the ability to go and I have enough paintings done. So I figured these small canvases would be perfect for the occasion, you know, just something simple to paint on, something simple to sell to people that they would enjoy. And without further ado, let's show y'all the sketches that I have created. So I have a few different designs that I've all done on this. We have a heron with some grapes. We have this rooster just with some leaves and like some hay. Then we have a pheasant with some eggs and some roses two cardinals, I'll probably fill out the background while I'm painting, and then some mallard ducks, and then this cool lady with like praying mantises on her face, just because, I don't know, I didn't, I didn't know what to do, I thought it would be fun. The one that I'm going to be doing today is the pheasant design with the roses, so let's get right into it. All right, so first off, I'm really sorry about the lighting. You know, I was painting later in the day and my desk is like on the opposite side of my room from my window, so it is darker than I would have liked, but thankfully the footage turned out pretty good. You know, I gave myself a limited palette because I really wanted to try and see what I could do with pinks and stuff, even though the reference photo I had was brown. But either way, I'm really, really happy with how it turned out and I hope you guys like it as well. You know, this entire little process has been really, really wonderful. This is probably my most favorite painting I've done in like a really, really long time. Like, I went through a period, you know, in the last few months of, you know, like I went to this art festival and I pushed and pushed and pushed and pushed to get it done. And I feel like I kind of burnt myself out from that a little bit and I've been trying to get back into painting stuff that I love more than anything and rather than things that I'm just painting to sell and you know trying to sell your art there's a very fine line of making things that the general public would like to consume and things that you enjoy making this piece I feel is a perfect balance of both because not only do I love it did I have a very very fun painting experience with it but i do genuinely feel like this is something that someone would love in their house you know this one woman in a gallery once told me that you know the best thing to do with people when you're trying to sell is to make paintings color-coded because a lot of people have different rooms in their houses that are themed off of different things and sure this painting won't fit into absolutely everyone's house but I really love it. I absolutely, I love, love, love this painting. I think it is like the most beautiful thing I've done in a while and I'm very happy with it. And, um, you know, thank you for watching this, you know, little video of mine. I know I don't upload that often, but I'm going to change that. I'd like to make a little video like this with every painting I do, um, for this little series. And whenever I do, um, go to that flea market, I want to make a video of that as well because, I feel like it would be fun to document more stuff, you know, just because like I've always wanted to do like videos like this and stuff, but I've just never really um, had the motivation to do so. But I'm feeling better in my life, you know, I feel like I can do really beautiful stuff like this again. I think this is a great opportunity. So like I said, thanks for watching and I hope you guys like my painting and if you guys want prints made at all, um, just let me know and I'll probably have that done.
Okay.